Hey everybody, how you doing? Thanks for joining me again, my friends. Poet WP here. I uh, wrote a poem about a day or two ago. I was quite pleased with. It was a departure from my general uh, style. I wrote it more along the lines of how a rock and roll song would sound. Maybe. I don't know. At least that was my impression. Opinions may vary. Anyway, enough describing the poem. Let's get on to reading it. Um, and I, normally, you know, I had been doing poems where I read it after I typed it up, but and I was going to do that, but I, I've been writing a lot lately, and I feel the urgency and the need to get it out just like as soon as I can. And I've been so busy, I just haven't had as much time to type up what I would like to. Um, and I eventually will get it typed up, of course. And, and eventually this will all be in a book. I'm not sure how many people will end up buying it. But, um, you know, that's not really the point. The point is to do it. Anyway, on to the poem. Uh, sorry, I uh, rambled on a little excessively. Uh, this one's called... For some reason, I got to thinking about David and Goliath. The story of David and Goliath. And uh, it inspired me to write a poem. This is called The Sling and Stone of Perfect Faith. One stone, just one, only an ounce or two, from a sling of absolute faith. Let me Cyclops plug that third eye for you. I'll do it in dreams, I'll do it in bars, I'll do it in street corners, I'll do it in street corners of disillusion. I'll do it in the vacuum of nothingness. We will slay the dragon in, in, in spaceless time. We will manifest the ethereal into the physical plane, drawing the message like a magnet. All the transmuted pain of the dead who have your names on their lips are ready to peddle their justice with your pound of flesh. Your smart bomb strategies will heat-seek your karma into oblivion. The blood metallic flavor can no longer pacify your inferiority. They waterboard your eyes with sin. Behind the veil, you may not see it yet, but you are already standing on the gallows. Your zero hour is so compounded that it will echo throughout eternity. A legend. It turned out the hubris of the powers that be will be their undoing. The fool inverse bound by the devil and destined for the tower. Oh dear earth, put your dead karma where it belongs, in the grave. Okay. Thank you very much for uh, taking the time to allow me to share a piece of my poetry with you. I hope uh, some truth, maybe even a little wisdom, can be imparted with it. Keep fighting the good fight. Stand up for what you know is right. And do not yield. Because now is the time where we're all going to be tested. You better get your ethics in order. And you better stand up. Okay. See you in the next one. Like, share, and subscribe if you're so inclined. Thank you very much for listening.